back. My name is Jamie. If you're new to my channel, I own Glam Event Rental, which is a party rental company that's based in Dallas, Texas. And the content on my channel is basically going to be me doing different setups based on themes or color schemes. So if there's something in particular that you want to see, go ahead and leave a comment below. And if you're interested in getting um, decorating tips, business tips, encouragement inspiration whatever um as far as being a business owner being a in particular a party rental business owner or a balloon artist event planner anything in that realm where you're dealing with parties then go ahead and subscribe to my channel because i promise you're gonna love it here all right so i have all of my balloons blown up and they're in this bag because I have um, a black Labrador Retriever and she sheds everywhere. And even when I vacuum the floor right before I do my setup, I still get dog hair everywhere. So I just inflate my balloons and put them straight in the bag. And then that way I don't even have to deal with it. So today we are doing a teddy bear theme. So that is the reason for these neutral color balloons. And my preferred method of my garland is the fishing line. So, I know everybody has like their own preference. Um, I know some people prefer using 260s. I've done the 260 method before. It looks gorgeous. However, it takes forever. And I kind of found a way to do the um, fishing line method to where it looks fairly close to the way it looks when I use the 260 method. So I will explain in a moment. So right now I'm just starting out by tying a knot at the beginning. Oh my goodness. Hang on, I got my facial line tangled up. Y'all probably like, yeah, that's why I use 260s. <laughs> together so I don't know if you guys can see that so this is one cluster here this is the nozzle like these are the nozzles of one cluster these are the nozzles of my second cluster and I pull them together like this to make it tight and then I go ahead and use the figure eight method to combine the clusters together one thing you do have to be careful about is making sure that your thumb doesn't get caught up in the fishing line. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see that or not. Making sure that your thumb doesn't get caught up in the fishing line. So I just kind of pull together, I mean push them together and then pull my finger out. And then there you go. It's nice and tight. Just like it would be if it was um, two sixties in there. All right, so this is normally the part where I would cue the music and then speed the video up. However, I have a story to tell y'all. So, basically, I, you guys know from like, if you watch any of my other videos, you guys know that since I started this business about a year ago, I have um, also been working a nine to five. I've been working full time. So, um, I feel like my business could be, I could be, doing a lot better than what I'm currently doing. I feel like my YouTube channel could have gotten a lot more traction than what it's gotten. The problem is just that I didn't have enough time and energy to invest in my business the way I wanted to. So I had, I had eventually gotten to the point to where I was just going to quit. And um, I was just gonna focus on my business full time. Cause I'm like, okay, you know, my husband works full time, whatever, we'll just have to figure it out. You know, I'm just gonna take a leap of faith. And um, I just kept saying to myself, like, if I was able to work part time, that would be amazing because 
you guys know I work for United Healthcare and the benefits there are really, really good. So I, I really didn't want to leave my job. I just was kind of prepared to leave my job, especially um, like the last straw for me was the fact that um, we had an annual review and the raise that they gave me was only a one and a half percent raise. And um, maybe I shouldn't even be saying this because I don't want to, want to put the company on blast. Like, I really do like my job. Um, but anyway, you guys know with the rate of inflation right now, everything is super expensive. I mean, gas, price of gas has gone up. The cost of food has gone up. Like, everything is expensive now. So, I kind of felt it really was unfair to the employees to only give us a one and a half percent raise but i kind of understood too like the company can only do so much so anyway that was kind of the last straw for me because i'm just like with inflation being i don't know probably somewhere around eight percent right now the one and a half percent raise to me is just kind of like okay that's that's almost kind of like a, a pay decrease because <laughs> If inflation is going up faster than my pay, eventually, like I make basically I'm making less money the longer I stay here. So even though um with my party rental business, I wasn't making the same amount of money that I was making at my job, I figured that if I had more time and energy to put towards what my passion really was, then I'd be able to get there a lot faster. So anyway, I was going to quit, but then I just kept saying, well, if they have part time, that would be perfect. And every time I would talk to somebody about me quitting my job, I would always say, but if they have part time, that would be amazing. So then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, they just said they are going to allow their employees to work part time. And I was like, what? Like manifestation who? So yeah. Basically, I got the opportunity to start working part-time. So, at this point, I only work three days a week at my um, regular job. And then I get to spend the other time doing what I love, which is this. So, with that being said, um, I'm going to be doing a lot more videos and posting a lot more consistently. So... If you guys really, really like what I do on my channel, please show me your support. Show me that I made the right decision <laughs> going part-time in my job. Um, but anyway, yeah, I just kind of wanted to share that with you guys and offer some inspiration because um, I know that it can be really discouraging if you're just doing the best that you can. You feel like the quality of work that you do is amazing, but the customers aren't coming like they're supposed to I feel like the real issue in my situation anyway was just that I didn't have the um the extra time and the energy I mean I'm married I have two kids you know it's somebody always needs me so if it wasn't my job if it wasn't my business it was my husband or, or it was one of my two kids and I got a dog so it's just kind of like um you know, I just didn't have the energy and I know I, I know a lot of um, other people who are in this business are moms or wives or they, even if you're not married, you have a significant other and you can relate to that feeling of always being needed by someone and then what you really need to do always comes last, you know? So I just said that to say this, um, find a way to make it work for you if that's going part-time at your job or if that's quitting your job or whatever it is that you need to do then go ahead and do that just so that you can follow your dreams and just um have a little bit more faith in yourself and give yourself some grace um to allow to grow your business and because it takes time so anyway i'm gonna stop running my mouth now and i'm gonna go ahead and speak this video up four friends come in droves Take flight, was never on the same court. Them guys, nah, not I. If we judge a book, try reading it. Before blasting all of your insta feeding it, lying through your teeth.
So how about you try wiping the lens for taking the picture first? It'll save you some time. You can be all you want, but you're broken in mind. Check on the motor inside. Somebody always needs me. And the dog too. Okay, gotta go back upstairs now. Go cash. Go upstairs with your brother. Bye. For this setup, I am using Semprotex brand balloons in the colors Peach Blush, White Sand, Coffee, and Chocolate. And they are double stuffed with the exception of the five inch balloons because it just didn't seem necessary to double stuff them. However, I did wanna show you guys a tip in case you're double stuffing for the purpose of getting a custom color. Um, I know that a lot of balloon pumps don't have the capacity to inflate double stuffed five inch balloons. So here's how I do it. These balloons here are already double stuffed and as you can see the pump is not powerful enough to inflate them. So what I do is I inflate the 5 inch balloons individually. And then after individually inflating, I go ahead and use a metal straw to double stuff them. And now the pump is able to inflate. Okay, so I think this is a good stopping point. I'm going to add some more about... Um... I'm going to add some more balloons in, but right now this is a good stopping point. Um, I just want to get this garland up so that I can make sure that it's rounding out the way I want it to. So, um, let me grab some 260s. I'm, I'm not that sure. I don't think I need a step stool. <laughs> I don't think I need a step stool for this. Not yet, anyway. I don't remember if I said this already or not, but I put the um, safety pins up there before I put the cover onto the round back drop because this, let me tell you, is a struggle to get this round back drop cover, or should I say to get the cover on the round back drop, to get it zipped up. Oh my God, it's so hard. Um, so you have to get the safety pins on there first because it has zero give to it zero so anyway let's get this up here what i have so far okay i might need my step stool now We got that up i'm gonna add some more balloons here let me show you up close actually so i'm gonna be adding in some more balloons to fill in this dead space down here
is what it's looking like so far don't mind that one different color balloon I'm gonna ask some more in All right, so I got all the balloons on and this is what we're looking like so far. I did buy some pompous grass and I wanna try it out. However, it's not as long as I wanted it to be. So I'm gonna try and put it on here. If it doesn't look right, I'm just gonna take it off. So we'll see. I'm amused Hope my interests don't confuse you But I like to test the waters before I dive I'm in search of something new I'm familiar to my eyes Lately earth been standing still I've been looking for the motion Got a two room flat with your girl for the moment Got a new plug here today Night to show them off Got a neighbor who complain About the smoking on the loft Gotta leave my son up Little demo out of card What a dive for this life is 16 All the things you see on the big screen. All right, so what I noticed about this pump is grass is that as soon as I started trying to place it in the balloons, it's shedding all over the balloons. So I realized I have to like it now <laughs> and commit to this design because if I take away the pump is grass, all this lint all over the balloons is not gonna make any sense. So I had to keep it in there, but Luckily, I like it actually. Um, so I'm gonna keep it in here. I wish I could get it all going the same direction. I think that's good. Kind of like the design with them all going the same direction. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and pull in the rest of the decorations and then get the final look and that'll be the end of this video. So I'll be right back.
that's what we could call.